Dear aquarist, well, I was at Interzoo 2022 last week, but this is not live from Interzoo. This is from my home office where I will show you my presentation that I brought at the largest trade show in the world and at the booth of Aquarium Münster in, in Germany. So I will give you my short presentation, which you might have missed because you didn't have a chance to, to come meet and greet. It was a lovely show. We met uh, many nice people. We had did a lot of good business. And, and let me share you my, my screen so I can show you my PowerPoint. Because I, I talked about the prevention and the control of fish diseases, which is an important part if you wanna keep our fish healthy. The summary is about uh, the immune system and what can we do with the help of uh, fish food? What is the advantage of our Dr. Basslier uh, buy fish food the better taps? And how can we control bacterial infections with Dr. Basslier buy fish food FUCO? Those were the new products which we were presented uh, since 2018, which we didn't have an interview at 2020. So, we presented them at this show we just had uh, a few days ago. Well, as many of you know, the origin of fish diseases is usually, or most cases, due to the stress. The stress can be many factors. And when the stress has an impact on the fish, the microbe has a chance to become an infection. And the origin of those problems and diseases can be temperature, a pH, ammonia, all stress factors, but also aggression of poor feeding. And that's something I want to stress today on my uh, presentation, so that the microbe has an opportunity to affect like this uh, longerosities butterfly. You see the red wounds, the damage. Well, this was usually due to this case by transport. But we do sometimes forget what the feeding can be a problem when you do it not correctly. And one of those wrong feeding uh, things or features that happen in our hobby is that we stick a tablet here to the side of the aquarium where we can observe the fish coming to eat. Well, it looks beautiful, but is it good for the fish? Because here, the survival of the largest and the fittest will be well shown because the smaller ones and the weaker ones at the side will never have a chance to eat something from the tablet. So it will cause aggression and a causing stress. And that can happen in your home aquarium. Also, when you're not feeding properly, when you, for example, only feeding flake food to a tank here with uh, those kind of rainbow fish together with clown loach. The clown loach will never have a chance to eat something because the rainbow fish was faster. And the same with the plecostomus here. He will become skinny and die because the corridors are much faster and more active to feed or to eat on all that one tablet you're sticking to the aquarium. So if we think about us, about cruelty, see here the fight between a baby and a dog. Are you, who you think you will win? It will be the dog because he's more powerful and stronger. So the child will become hungry. And the same is for fish. Look here the fish fighting for the one tablet. And you might think, well, the big goldfish will be the one who I might take it all. And the molly or the, the, or the other fish have no chance until the angelfish, a chiclet, who is a very active animal in our aquarium, will take the tablet and takes it away. And all the other fish can forget to have a snap of the food. So we recommend to feed with our Dr. Baslier Bivers food better taps. They contain chlorella, which is an additional functional ingredient to help the health of your fish. And when you feed them several of those nice, large, better taps to the bottom of the aquarium, you can see the fish has a chance, all of them, to nibble on the food, the tetras, the cichlids, the corridoras. So if you feed of several of them, you will have no cruelty. Every fish has a chance to eat a part of it. So 
Now, the next step of my summary of my presentation of today is about avoiding distress and supplying a good food. And the good food, like I explained in many of my videos, is food with probiotica and prebiotica that helps the fish, his immune system to develop well and to fight against pathogens. So the food can help that the fish can build up a defense system, immune system. We know it's the same for mankind. If we don't have a good immune system, we will be prone to get diseases like a virus or a bacteria. Of course, good water and avoiding stress is an important part in our aquaria. If those conditions are not well fulfilled, well, it will be difficult that the food will be at help. So it's all part of one uh, global uh, actions you have to take is good care of your fish, but the food will play an important role in the immune system. And I'll explain here with a defense, defense system like the macrophages. Here is an example of mammal blood, uh, which is uh, different than the blood of a fish. You see the bacteria here, and you see the macrophage trying to eliminate the bacteria which is in the blood. And that helps to control bacterial infections. So if the fish has a lot of macrophages, he has a big defense system. And this is showing in studies which have been done particularly in larval stages of fish, then when you use uh, probi probiotics in the food, you have a very high survival rate. See, here is the survival rate, and here is the time schedule. So over the long time of the many weeks and months, you see a high survival rate with probiotics, and it avoids the use of antibiotics. Here we see the line of antibiotics, which of course can be in help for fish health but you don't have to use it if you use on a proper way the probiotics. If you use none of these, well, you see the very low survival rate. And that's why the whole aquatic and aquaculture industry recommends to use probiotics in the fish food. And that's what we do in our Dr. Baslier Biofish Food. And also it's preventing bacterial infections. Like here, four different bacterial infections on different uh, ornamental freshwater fish. Here, columnaris on the beta. And on the marine fish, he also columnaris on this Achilles tank. And here, vibra vibrio on the antia. So bacterial infections are very common in our aquarium fish because we keep them in tropical conditions, which is favorable for the bacteria to grow fast. And for this reason, we developed our Dr. Baslier Biofish Food FUCO I recommend to give a course of 14 to 20 days feeding to help the fish to survive bacterial infections such as columnaris and bacterium. Well, the clock is ringing. It, needs, it means that I might stop my presentation within a few minutes. So stay on and I will finish my presentation when the clock starts ringing. Well, the new Dr. Basley Biofish Food, that's granulates which are covered with fucoidan, which is an extract of the marine algae kelp or laminaria. And it also contains the probiotic Spediococcus bacteria, which helps the microbiome of the gut, and the prebiotics, the beta glucans or extracts from yeast, Saccharomyces, that helps to stimulate the microbiome and the bacteria. So this all together is, is a package of health, of functional food, with, uh, to, certainly with the fucoidan that helps to fight off bacterial infections. This is the kelp coming from nature, a very important ingredient. Uh, those things are not invented for nothing. They are made for aquaculture, like it has been tested here in this uh, examination or uh, experimental procedure uh, done by a university uh, of to decrease the mortalities of Nile tilapi, tilapia, which were dying of columnaris. And they find out that when they used this fucoidum, the injury level was much smaller than when it was not treated with fucoidum. This was the control group, which had, of course, 
uh, no infection of columnarises. Infected with columnaris, you see a much lower incidence of damage to the fish due to the application of fucoidon. And we did the test ourselves in our laboratory. Here the day one, we had this uh, gourami with a bacterial infection, columnaris. You see the tail rotting away and the white lesion. And after 12 days of feeding, we saw the repair of the tail and we saw the white spot disappearing. So without any use of antibiotics, just feeding the Dr. Baslier Bifers Food Fuco was helping the fish to overcome the disease because what is important and to remind you that the fish must still be eating. If the fish is not eating, of course the food will not help. And you must do it as soon as you can in the beginning stage of the disease. That's the same for any animal you want to save in your aquarium. Act properly and act quickly and use many other kinds of Dr. Basley or Biofish Food. You want to learn more about fish diseases? Well, I have several books which are available on my website, kerelbasler.com. And these books might help you to understand fish diseases and what you can learn from it. Of course, you can also subscribe to my YouTube channel, channel where I give a lot of training uh, and help on uh, caring about your fish. So this was not from Interzoo, but I have the background there. I was there for four days and I met many of you, maybe who are watching this video, and maybe I see the next Interzoo at 2024. Let's hope so that we can meet and greet and exchange our ideas and and our trial and errors on fish diseases and treatments. Thank you for watching and take good care.